Now, the Valley's first responder on WZDX News. She's been a paramedic in Alabama for 20 years and has been interested in the field ever since she was a kid. We're talking about this month's Valley's first responder, Jill Meyer Schultz. She's passionate about her job and Hemsey is lucky to have her because it was her quick thinking that helped save a life one Friday night. This is Jill Meyer Schultz. She's been a paramedic in Alabama for 20 years, and she's had an interest in the field ever since she was a kid. Back in my childhood, my mom was a Girl Scout leader, and um, she always needed somebody that was first aid qualified to be able to take the girls camping off site. And so um, I was always her first aid qualifier, and I really got interested in it from that point. Jill loves what she does because of the positive effect she can have on people's lives. It's, um, you get to help people. You get to help them at their worst moment and make a difference. I mean, every second that you're out there, you're changing somebody's life. And in terms of top-notch care, she says Hemsey always brings its A-game. I've worked for private companies and for lower-income um, ambulance services, and uh, we just didn't have the quality of the stuff to be able to take care of the patients to the level that we want it to. And here at Hemsey, I mean, they, they keep us at the high level all the time. Jill was nominated to be the Valley's first responder by Mark Russell, a former Huntsville councilman who went into cardiac arrest at a local football game. Her quick thinking saved a life that night. Things had been going pretty normal, just ha as every other football game had on a Friday night. And um, we were sitting down for the moment, uh, taking a break, getting something to drink, when he crossed in front of us, took about 10 feet in front of us, and then unfortunately collapsed. And, uh, you know, it didn't take us but a second to realize that, you know, we were needed. And we grabbed the equipment, we went to his side. Um, there was a nurse that was there. She happened to, uh, is one of the assistant coaches, his wife, and she does photography there. She rolled him over, started chest compressions, we brought our equipment, we kind of, you know, all got into flow, got into the same routine, and it just, you know, it all worked out for the best. As cliche as it may sound, being a paramedic has taught Jill that you never know what you're going to get, and that's the most rewarding part. Every day is a different day. Uh, you get to see things that you never would think in your lifetime that you would get to see. You get to experience things. You get to learn things about yourself that you didn't think you would knew. Um, see yourself in situations that you didn't think you would get through. And then afterwards, you sit back and reflect on it and think, wow, you know, we did that. And that's the best part of the job. Thank you, Jill, for all that you do for the community. If you'd like to nominate a Valley's first responder, just go to our Rocket City Now app or website, click on the Community tab, and select Valley's first responder.